So uh, this example says only 93% of airplane parts being examined pass inspection. What is the probability that all the next five parts examined will pass inspection? So we have some multiple <coughs> events. We have, um, you could basically say that probability A would be the, um, the first part, which is 93%. Then we need to, the second event is them second the, test, the next parts, right? It says, what is the probability that the next five parts? So we have five parts. We have five events. Each event, though, each probability of each part has its own probability. Where A, B, C, D, and E all represent different parts, right? Does that kind of make sense? They say, what's the probability of the next five events, um, or the next five parts being examined, pass inspection? Well, for each part, it's 93%. So is this a, they're not asking it's an and or an or, but this would be an example of an and. So if you guys remember, when we're talking about the and, the probability of an and would be to multiply our events. So they're asking, not only is it this one going to pass, but will this part pass? This part, this part, this part, and this part, right? They're asking for all of them, all of them to be included to be able to pass. So what's the probability? So what we need to do is probability of A times the probability of B times the probability of C times the probability of D times the probability of E. So then, Ryan, all I simply need to do is get out my calculator and multiply 0.93 by itself five times. Or to simplify this process, we could also write 0.93 raised to what power? Fifth power. And when we do that, we get 0.93 raised to the fifth power is? Yes, Gavin? 69.6%. OK. Yes, question, sir? I don't know. But they're all multiplied. Does everybody see why we're multiplying them and not adding them? And adding them would be an or. It's ba that would be basically like, what's the probability of the first one passing inspection plus the second one passing inspection, or the third one passing inspection, or the fourth one, right? That's not asking or. They're saying, what's the probability of this inspection passing and the next inspection passing and the next inspection passing? So since we're using and, we're multiplying these probabilities. Yes? Could you have done 0.93 Right. That's what the student did. Yeah, I said instead of multiplying it by five times, which I wrote out, we obviously, hopefully, we're, we know that we can simplify multiplying a number by itself five times and just raising it to the fifth power. Cool? Capiche? Comprende?